Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Nastrin Padasali. So in this video, I'm going to tell you total number of candidates who actually write this Department of Biotechnology that is Biotechnology Eligibility Test 2022. You all know this BIT exam 2022 is going to be conducted in the month of April and if you are the one who are planning to write the examination means definitely you should know how many students who wrote this examination and many students are not aware about this particular examination thinking like they are clearing this BIT examination is very much tough. But when you compare with is a CACR examination means as many students are well known and well aware about CACR examination friends. So I am showing this official information. Okay, if you take December month 2019 examination schedule, if you take total number of students who actually registered with respect to life sciences, since you know this joint CACR exam is not really conducted for life sciences student, it do conducted for chemical sciences, physical sciences and mathematical sciences. If you take life sciences, nearly 1 lakh student will apply play that is registered for life science examination and if you see that statistics of uh, number of students who actually wrote the examination it is 83,000 which is little bit higher you need to compete with the 80,000 student only then you can clear the examination at the same time among this 83 student not all the student will get the fellowship only 4,000 student or as a whole I am saying friends with respect to life sciences only 1,000 student will get the fellowship okay as a whole you need to consider chemical senses earth everything as a whole every year jr of alone 4000 uh, seats alone allotted with respect to life senses if you ask me only 800 to 1000 seats will be given this is with respect to CSR examination but if you take this biotechnology entrance text or biotechnology eligibility test simply if you search in internet like how many students will actually apply or write this biotechnology eligibility test one of the famous website they have given an answer saying that only thousand students will apply for this biotechnology eligibility test that is with data before five years but within this five years many students are getting aware at the same time this biotechnology that is department of biotechnology is setting up the question paper to different levels not that mean that much easy level like before five years it was easy the question paper but once the students are getting aware more and more number of students will be applied okay but i can say nearly 5000 student alone will write this biotechnology eligibility test the reason is that this exam is not that much uh, created that much awareness among student many students are depending only on the CSCR examination you might be one among those student okay next reason many students are thinking only biotechnology student alone clear this examination if you are thinking in that manner then i would suggest you to download this bet exam question paper and just try to work down even if you are a bio botany student a biochemistry student or zoology student or microbiology student you can also clear the examination that's a major major thing and you should think in a smart way of clearing this examination as soon as possible so my personal suggestion is that if you can't able to compete with this 83,000 of students you can compete with 5,000 students okay so this was the thing that I need to share with you friends I hope I had provided you a detailed explanation of how many students will actually write this examination if you are in a plan either to apply for this exam or not to apply for this exam I would suggest you to apply for this examination okay and get to know get to know an idea about question pattern everything definitely you can clear this biotechnology eligibility test because after clearing CSCR and after clearing BT your life will be same only but clearing this BT examination is very much advantageous as you all know I had cleared this exam in first attempt only friends okay next important thing is that with respect to fellowship also it is equal CACR is also offering 35,000 as a fellowship and this biotechnology eligibility like those students who are cleared under this bet examination will also get 35,000 along with the JRF and the con contingency grant for this biotechnology eligibility test is little bit higher CAC has given 20,000 20, whereas this bet exam cleared candidate will get 30,000 I think so so there are various advantages to write this examination also if you after clearing the examination directly the salary will be credited in your bank account itself no need to search over institution and no need to provide enough document so there are various advantages that a student will get benefited so please apply as soon as possible and this will be a little bit motivation as well as eye opening for all students okay so thank you friends thanks for watching this video if this if this information if you found this particular information is useful then please don't subscribe please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel okay so thank you friends thanks for watching this video